Bonjour, ça va bien. We're in Paris. Oh my god. So if you haven't already guessed, I don't like vlogging and traveling. It's just so stressful, especially when you're with Connor and he acts like a 12 year old child. It's just not fun. So we arrived in Paris. Look at that. This oh. morning, but us being the adventure king and queen that we are, our hotel is literally three hours away from the airport. Gorgeous. So we had to get a two hour bus journey, and then a subway, and now a walk. But the child got hungry and had to stop halfway, so. Oh. Beautiful. We're like three minutes away from the hotel as well, <laughs> but we still need to stop. So yeah, we've nothing planned while we're here, but we just get married. But we just want to explore. And we'll bring it along with us. Look at that bus! We are check we went to the hotel but we can't check in until 3 o'clock. What time is it now? Half 12 or so. I had a little wrap thingy and it was lovely and then I got a bar and now we don't know where we're going. We're going to point. Do you wanna go get have a point first? Very busy. Yeah, so we where are you? We uh, go to the end of the earth with you. Oh, that's weird. <laughs> we flew into boat. Ow! We flew into boat. We flew into Bovo Airport or something Bovo. like that. Bovo! Bovo! And it Smallest was... Smallest airport in the world. It was a very small airport, yeah, but it was miles away. So three got like, hours. No, it wasn't three hours, was you were like. And yeah, so if you're flying in again, we'd we'll definitely be going to Charles de Gaulle. And there she's gone. Hello. Go on. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with you? I went into that sweet shop. Lost in Paris. <laughs> Don't ever do that again. I didn't go in there. Oh, who told you I went into this sweet shop? Wow, wow, wow. The lilac. You know. <laughs> oh, does here. he want him to take a picture? I'm gonna ask him. Ask him then. Yeah, yeah go Where ask him. Asking? No, on. you ask him. No, go on. Handy little job. Yeah, get down on it. Uh, uh. Get down on it. Get down on it. I go anywhere, anywhere with you. Cause you feel my mind. Oh, you feel my mind. We could build a dream, start up something new. Let the old be dead. <laughs> Holy smokes! Like, who needs this many bedrooms? Honest to God, this is amazing to see them. Big tennis court. It's amazing. Absolutely amazing. Give us a wave there, Ellie. Hi, Mom. <laughs> On your skill trip. So we are in the Louvre right now. It's pretty hard to say, isn't it? Um, we're just going. We're actually just here to see Mona Lisa, to be honest with you, because we don't know anything, anyone else that's here. Go. Everyone else comes to the, this place to look at pictures, not you're sliding around. Well, would you recommend coming here? No. Until you see. Mona. But isn't it mad that they could make something like that years and years ago? Crazy. No, it actually is like. How it rocks, like just it's like scarping yeah. a crepe. It's well, scarping like, that. How they get so smooth and all. It's weird. He has no toes or no nose. He has only one foot as well. Completely. 
There's honestly too many people as well. There's one million people in here. There is one million people, I think. 15 euro ahead, so what's 1 million multiplied by 15? 15 million. Yes, Elio. Is it? Turn your honours, Matt. Little pit stop in it. What are we getting? 16 euro of electric. So this, we've been here about seven hours and we've had three meals. We haven't really. Well, I've had one. So we stopped for a McDonald's there. Now we're on the hunt for Louis Vuitton. Every single video I'd say Ellie's been on her phone. But that's the usual Ellie. What? Nothing. Get them? Yeah. Lovely stuff. So I got Ellie. A little present for being amazing and for getting our like new lip kits and all out. What did you get? More runners. More runners. Yeah, More exactly fucking runners. More runners. More runners. That's your boots. Uh, Two saps. Where's your neck? <laughs> Four oh one and four oh two. Oh my god. Go. Go. Hello? Shh. What the hell? Oh, look, there's that two. That is so weird. Where mind, are you now? Mind them, mind yeah, I will mind them, yeah. Cute. Yeah? Yeah. Now, where are we? Uh, and they make cute little cheese and trash box. They do fondant. What's that? Fondant always reminds me of uh, Jummy Cockers. Oh, and they just did things into it, yeah? yeah. You don't like cheese? Like, I'm getting my sister and chips, Connor's getting. I don't know what you got, like, ham and cheese pancakes. Mad. Um, and then we have to get a crepe tonight. Crepe city. I'm still here. Yeah, I know. So I got a ham and cheese pancake bread. Voila. So this is what I got. Like a salmon tagliatelli. What do we have here? So she's happy now, just because she got a crap Nutella honey. May I have a bite? Just one, right? Not yet, you can have a first. I'll measure how much you can have. Not the rest. Yeah, yeah. I'm My mouth is actually salivating. Sal what's it called? Salivation. Will I be in the box? Well, how many are you gonna get? Just a small bit. A box or a bag? A bag. Is that many of them? Yeah. That's two. Yeah, I gave it two. You want one as well? And then I'm gonna get. What's oh, probably? You yeah, still really like it, so I'll get four. How many times have you cried in the whole day so far? True. And what was the first time over? Because I was tired. The second time? Because I got lost. Third time. <laughs> so good morning everyone, welcome to day two in Paris. Oh yeah, like a nut in it. We're going on a little stroll now to find some real French coffee. We're going to get Starbucks. You can't come to Paris and get Starbucks, so. My country chocolate. Paris day two, we'll bring it along. One thing I do have to say about Paris stuff, it's very, very expensive. Even just for little things. Like your bar of chocolate was what, three euro? For yeah. a little bar of chocolate? Um, it's expensive, but obviously it's a tourist place, so they get the moolah. Oh yeah, we'll bring you, ooh, pigeons. We'll bring you, what is it today? So we have a, well all together from where we started, it was a 15 minute walk to the Eiffel Tower. So we're just gonna stroll, do a little bit of shopping on the way, hopefully get some food. And a coffee. Connor, what were you thinking about doing the Moulin Rouge? We've gotten a few messages to say. Connor, actually, somebody else also told me to do the hop on, hop off tour. Fun fact Connor used to work on a hop on, hop off tour. <laughs> no, no. We've gotten suggestions to do the Moulin Rouge tonight, so we might do that as well. But and now we're just. We obviously sure. wish we were doing uh, Disneyland. Oh, yeah. No, because we're only here till our flight tomorrow on Sunday is at 10 past 5. But it takes two hours to get to the airport from a bus. 
And to get to the bus stop, I think it's about, oh, we don't know. Yeah, it's just a, a little bit of a trek, so we want to make sure we're in the airport on time, so we won't be doing, won't be doing anything tomorrow, really. Um, so today is kind of our last day. Last day. We basically and, and came to Paris day. for a day. Yeah. <laughs> right, go. First bite review. Of a, <laughs> of a croissant in France. Much better than the ones from Lidl, anyway. Oh, three Jesus. Christ. Very good now. Halfway there now. Yeah. Right. I'm change of outfits. Change of outfits. Ellie has my coat on now oh. and a scarf. And I have a little. It's like a rain jacket, but it's padded. I told him not to come near me. Yeah, I'm not out near Ellie in it because it's white. Yeah, we're still on the way. Minutes 23 minutes of our 50 minute walk to the Eiffel Tower. Ellie has only moaned once. I only cried three times. <laughs> oh, nearly there. It's fucking huge as well. Do you want to go up it? Can we? Yeah? Lego. It's so cool to see it in real life though. So we have stopped for a little brunch lunch at... What's it called? Le Champ de Mars Party. You butchered that definitely. Uh, what are we going to get? We're going to try snails for the first time. But yeah, I'm fucking... What are they called in French? Escargot. Escargot. We're going to try escargot. I'm going to get a fat beer. I want to try oysters as well. Oysters as well. And then we want to try... What are they called? The sweet yolks. The oh, macaroons. Macaroons as well. So, I've just said to Ellie there, like, where do you think they catch the snails? Because I think they catch them on the ground. Oh, there isn't somebody just going around picking them up off the mud and all. I think they're from the sea. I think they're like sea snails. No, no, no. Hold on. Where do you find... If they say the ground, I already feel a bit sick. <laughs> Is there a difference between regular snails and the snails eaten in France as escargot? Or could I head out to the garden and toss pesky critters into my frying pan? I'm shit. <laughs> <laughs> Look at them things. Oh, he's going to do it. <laughs> He's gonna do it. You're gonna do it straight after. Yeah, but you're doing it first. Show the camera. <laughs> yeah? No, you liar. What does it taste like? Yeah, it's good stock. What does it taste like? It tastes like mussels. Does it? A little bit. Oh, God. No, actually, are nice. Are they? Yeah. I'm trying to find a small. <laughs> Oh, like we got six, like. Show the camera. Yeah. Go right in and pull it out. <laughs> Ooh. Connor, they're so big. Go. In you go. It's not as bad as you think. It's not that bad. <laughs> well. <laughs> I don't know what they taste like, but I think it's just the fact of knowing what it is. <laughs> just out of that little restaurant for lunch. Well, it was funny at dinner. We got a fucking, we got a starter. Your man comes over and was like, oh, the garlic bread here is very nice. No, we, na nails were coming. Nails. Nails were coming and he was like, do you want uh, to eat garlic bread with the snails? Like, just thinking, oh, like, we'll give you he's a little slice. He's going to throw yeah. in the garlic bread or something nah. like that. Then the bill came. Garlic bread was 9 dollars <laughs> I thought he was just being yeah, nice. Yeah. There is some queues in the Eiffel Tower. <laughs> so these are all of our tickets. This is Ellie. Hi. The shy crack queen. Oh. So we're currently in the queue to go up the Eiffel Tower. We've been in the queue about an hour. Yeah. Yeah, haven't even like the queue to buy your tickets. Not even to go up to buy. I think we're gonna grab a bed over here. It's not ordered, is it? No, I think, I think we want a French baguette and do a good job. Like a French baguette, but it looks fast, like we've seen it now, you know? Uh, so yeah, if you're coming here again, just buy tickets before you come, yeah? Because we are leaving now, are we? Yeah. 
Oh, really? I know you're just like. Oh, scared. God. Oh, no. I think she's giving out, Belle. Let's hear if she's giving out, Belle, now. What are you giving out, Belle? Walking. What do you want? I'll drop it. What are you gonna get? Ellie. Connor. What's the story? What's up? What are we doing now? We're going for a few points. So we have got changed. Can I just one? Got changed, now we're going for a drink and dinner. But the lift went we got on at four, went up to eight, then stopped at seven. Then four, then two, then, two, then one, now and now we're here. here. Thank God. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, so strong. Hello, cutie. I forgot my tripods off. This is a bit shaky. It's because I'm just holding up my hand. This is our last morning in Paris. We are flying home at 5 o'clock today, but it's going to take us 4 o'clock today. Oh, I have the time difference. Um, so it's going to take us a while to the air airport, so get to the airport. So I'd rather be safe than sorry and leave um, early. Last night we went for drinks. Yeah, that's kind of all. Um, but for now, we're just going to go get a coffee and a bit of breakfast. It's like 11 o'clock here. Um, Let's check out the hotel at 12. And if anybody's wondering what hotel we stayed in, it was the Holiday Inn in Notre Dame. Um, it's a great location, like it's really central for all. There's loads of streets with like cafes and restaurants and little shops and stuff. Um, but then if you want to do things like the Eiffel Tower, it's about a 50 minute walk away from the Eiffel Tower just to give you this reference. But yeah, it's coffee time, because I clearly look like I need it. Do you love bread? Happy now, aren't you? Mm. You weren't happy a minute ago, aren't you? Now? Mm. What was wrong with you? Okay. Mm. Connor's gone down to a little market that I bought these in because I bought seven Eiffel Towers, like little keychain ones. And from there, from the little market, which is literally like a 20 second walk back to the hotel, I lost them all. So he's gone back to check that I not even take them with me. Um, then we have to get a taxi to the bus station. Two hour journey to the airport to get our flight. We're a little bit confused on the flight time because the clocks went back an hour. We gained an hour, I think. So Connor was asking, like, is the time on our boarding pass the time yesterday before the clocks went back? Or is it so? We're just really confused if we can't already tell. I'm just waiting on Coco to come back. With my key rings, hopefully. So it's home time. Bye, Paris. Bye.